We are back now with the potential impact of the federal budget battle on a way of life here in Hampton Roads, and this one could really hurt. The ship repair industry could take a hit if Congress does not allot a decent amount of money for it. Without the right amount of funding, if not thousands, hundreds if not thousands of people could be out of work. And on your sides, Mylena Belores is crunching the numbers with the people who know the industry best. Mylena. Tom, the Virginia Ship Repair Association represents 250 ship repair companies and about 27,000 employees in the area. I sat down with the president of the association today. He told me that depending on what happens Friday, around 1,000 people could be out of a job. Bill Crow loves what he does. We are an industry that is very proud, that's very passionate, and that's very patriotic. But his pride is now mixed with fear. A lack of funding could mean job cuts to the people he represents. That's because the appropriations bill and supplement provide the funding for 14 ship repair projects across the country. Three of those are in Hampton Roads. If those three availabilities evaporate, there will, there will be minimal amount of work in this port over the summer months, which will be catastrophic in regards to the industry and in regards to the layoffs. Since the start of the fiscal year in October, the government has been running on continuing resolutions, not a traditional budget. That's where Crow and Congressman Scott Taylor say the problems are coming from. The CRs are really hurting. They're really hurting them for predictability, for stability, and Newport News shipbuilding for the industrial base. Congressman Taylor is a member of the House Committee on Appropriations. He says he's working to help pass a full budget. And I am optimistic that we will have an agreement with the House and the Senate and move that to the president's desk. That may happen this week. Uh, or we may need a very, like a week-long CR to continue negotiations to get it done. Crow believes another continuing resolution would only hurt the Navy across the board, and his fear is becoming all too real as Friday's budget deadline approaches. You become uh, very, very concerned with all of a sudden we've gone from from okay we knew we were going to have a little bit of a problem to man oh man we're going to have the biggest problem we've ever had in our life of last year was bad this year will be bad as bad if not worse. Crow also says losing the jobs essentially means losing another line of defense because those people are fixing the Navy's ships. We did reach out to Congressman Bobby Scott, but he was not able to speak with us today. I'm Marielena Beloris, 10 on your side.